disulfide which I've been keeping in the freezer due to a low boiling point nice to pick that up but I don't have tweezers so uh, give me a minute okay here is a piece of white phosphorus which we're going to place into here we probably don't need this and, and I had some carbon disulfide which should dissolve the white phosphorus. Yes, it is. Still bits of phosphorus in there which are reacting with the air to produce phosphorus pentoxide, which, uh, well, it's not great to breathe, but it's, it's this stuff. Okay. The remainder of my dirty white phosphorus in water still. I would like to try and get some of the small chunks into there to dissolve it. Interesting looking bit. Dropped in there. You can see the smoke coming off it.
kind of just to burn while keeping the paper intact. Maybe the filter paper is special or it's just, I don't know, it's pretty much ash. Okay, this has been white phosphorus in carbon disulfide. Um, I'll do some more carbon disulfide chemistry with uh, using sulfur as well but uh, yeah this stuff should shouldn't be allowed to evaporate unless you want it to burn something I'll keep this maybe in the fridge 